Okay, how's everybody this morning? I don't know how you guys are going to be able to see here under the truck, but I'm pulling the front differential cover off. And uh, we're going to refill it. So. So how's everybody doing today anyways? There's crazy stuff going on where you live too. <coughs> it's getting nuts. But I enjoy doing this kind of stuff. I find it relaxing. And I had quite a leak from here. And it don't hurt to change this. Thing may have never been changed in 45 years. Well, I guess it must have been changed because somebody's got silicone all over here because they didn't want to buy a gasket, so they used silicone, which is uh, silly, right? When I first started doing this, you couldn't really buy pre made gaskets, you had to make your own out of gasket paper. Maybe I'll show you guys how to do that one day. Oh, I thought I undid all these ones. Oh, okay. Uh, hold on a sec here now. See if we can do this, get a little closer, get a little more torque on it. There we go. And we'll be easy, folks. The closer you can get to what you're undoing, the more torque you get on. And, uh, yeah, things are... You see a bunch of protests down in the States at the... Uh, I'm just looking to see... Oh, yeah, we're still filming. Um, at the Democratic Convention there. We got both sides protesting. Right? The poor Trump and... Uh, and then I guess one's for that are pissed off because Bernie Sanders isn't uh, the nominee and a bunch of stuff going on but you know it's good to see the police are starting to crack down some of this and what these protesters don't understand like you see them arresting a, a guy and a bunch of protesters are trying to pull a guy away from the police and that well I hate to tell you folks but that's a felony in itself I don't know the legal term for it, I'm not a lawyer, but I can guarantee it's some kind of felony, right? I don't know what it'd be, maybe disrupt an officer in his line of duty or something like that, who knows, right? It's hard to say. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do this, this front one here, show you guys, and then, uh, oh, because... Apparently I can pause my videos and then restart them, but I haven't figured out how to do it with my computer. So uh, that's what we'll do. We'll be part two with the back end. Right. And we'll see how this all works out. Hopefully good. God damn it, joint went out, eh? <laughs> That's no fun. Can't have that guy. Gotta be safe. I'll have to see when I fire the video up. See, I got a bit of a trendy leak there, too. I'm gonna have to find out where that's coming from. Fix it, too. Motor don't look like it leaks too much. I mean, it does a little, of course, that's par for the course. I mean, 45 years old is getting up there in time. Oh, yeah. 
I used to do this stuff in the shop up in a hoist. I'll tell you, it's a lot easier standing on the ground than laying on your back. I guess I'll have to. Oh, that's my son. My son is still asleep, but apparently he knows how to pause the video and restart it. So maybe we'll be able to put it back together and everything all in one shot. Oh, nice day here for working, though. It's a little cloudy. No hot sun beating on me. Right? And who knows how long this thing's been leaking. Well, for a long time, I can guarantee you. Right? I can just tell by it, looking at it. Okay. Now, I'm going to pop this off, make sure we and catch all the oil. Oh, I'll just boil all of it. <laughs> that ain't too bad. Hey, knife comes in handy, guys. Well, you think I wear it just for the hell of it? Nope, it's just another tool. Like every other tool in my tool belt or toolbox. It's just a tool. And there we go. I don't know how well you guys can see that differential, but you can see what it looks like. God damn, that's old and ugly oil. I can smell it. You can just smell the old stuff from the new stuff for sure, guys. Okay, uh, uh, I'm gonna try and upload this one. We'll see what goes on, but uh, be safe, guys. I can't.